The Mario Media franchise extends out of video games into non-game media. Mario and themes related to the franchise have appeared in television shows, anime, films, comics and manga, merchandise, and musical performance. Topic. Television Saturday Supercade was an animated television series produced for Saturday mornings by Ruby Spears Productions. It ran for two seasons on CBS, beginning in 1983. Each episode comprised several shorter segments featuring video game characters from the golden age of arcade games. Donkey Kong, Mario and Pauline from the Donkey Kong arcade game were featured in the show. The Super Mario Bros. Super Show, is the first American TV series based on the Mario NES games. It was broadcast in syndication from September 4 to December 1, 1989. The show was produced by Dick Entertainment and was distributed for syndicated television by Viacom Enterprises full rights have since reverted to Dick through Nintendo. A pitch for a Super Mario Bros. Series was announced at Dove Channel streaming service, will be produced by Studio Canal and Nelvana, but it got scrapped. King Koopa's Cool Cartoons was a live-action children's television show broadcast in Southern California during the holiday season of 1989-1990. The show starred King Koopa, also known as Bowser, the main antagonist of the Mario series. The 30-minute program was originally broadcast during the after-school afternoon time slots on Los Angeles-based KTTV Fox 11. The Adventures of Super Mario Bros. 3 is the second TV series based on the Mario NES games. It aired on NBC from September 8 to December 1, 1990. Based on the Super Mario Bros. 3 video game, the cartoon shows Mario, Luigi, Princess Toadstool and Toad fighting against Bowser and his Koopalings, who went by different names on the show. Like the previous Mario cartoon series, the animation was done by Say Young Animation Co. Limited, however this show was co-produced by Reed Italia SPA, hence the slight differences in character design. Super Mario Challenge was a show which aired on the Children's Channel. It ran from 1990 to 1991 and aired at 4.30 p.m. every weekday. The presenter, John Lenahan, was a lookalike of Mario, and dressed in his clothes. Two guest players had to do tasks, all of which involved playing the Mario video games Super Mario Bros., Super Mario Bros. 2 and, after its release in 1991, Super Mario Bros. 3. Rounds included challenges to see which player could complete a level in the fastest time and who could collect the most gold coins on a certain level. Super Mario World is an animated television series based on the SNES video game of the same name. It is the third and currently last Saturday morning cartoon based on the Mario series. The show was originally aired on Saturday mornings on NBC in the 1991-92 season. It was featured in a half-hour time slot with a shortened version of Captain N, the Game Master. Episodes of Super Mario World were later shown as part of the syndication package Captain N and the Video Game Masters. Afterwards, the series was split from Captain N altogether and shown in time compressed reruns on Mario All-Stars. Mario Ice Capades was a television special featuring a Mario-themed Ice Capades skating show, broadcast on ABC on December 28, 1989. It starred Christopher Hewitt as Bowser. Jason Bateman and Alyssa Milano also appeared in the special. Topic: <laughs> Films. Bowser and the Super Mushroom appeared in the 2012 Disney Computer animated film Wreck It Ralph. Mario is mentioned but not seen in the film. Mario's original arcade game appearance in Donkey Kong makes a cameo in the 2015 science fiction action comedy film Pixels. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Anime film. Super Mario Brothers: The Great Mission to Rescue Princess Peach, Japanese. Su pa Mario Bros. Zu pai kai ji ju chu da zu ozan Hepburn. Super Mario Bros. Zu Peachy Heim Kyushutsu Dai Sakasen is a 1986 anime film based on the Super Mario Brothers video game. Directed by Masami Hata and produced by Masakatsu Suzuki and Sunmasa Hatano, the plot centers on Mario and Luigi, who go on a quest to save Princess Peach from Bowser. 
It is notable for being the first movie based on a video game, predating the live-action Super Mario Bros. movie by seven years. Hollywood film Super Mario Bros. is a 1993 American science fiction comedy adventure fantasy film based on the Japanese video game series of the same name by Nintendo and distributed by the Walt Disney Studios through Hollywood Pictures, thus becoming one of several rare occasions where Disney and Nintendo have collaborated. The film was directed by Rocky Morton and Annabelle Yonkel, written by Parker Bennett, Terry Runte and Ed Solomon, and stars Bob Hoskins, John Leguizamo, Dennis Hopper, Samantha Mathis, Fisher Stevens, Fiona Shaw and Richard Edson. The story revolves around the titular Mario Brothers, as they find a parallel universe, ruled by the ruthless dictator King Koopa, who seeks to merge the two dimensions so that he can rule both worlds, leaving it up to Mario and Luigi to join forces with Princess Daisy, the daughter of the world's displaced king, to stop Koopa. Super Mario Brothers was shot in both New York City and North Carolina on a budget of $48 million. The film was released on May 28, 1993, in the United States and was unsuccessful both critically and commercially, receiving criticism for its storyline, characters and dialogue. However, the film was nominated for two Saturn Awards, one for Best Costume, the other for Best Makeup. Years later, however, commentators called it a cult film, and has spawned a fan-made website, a fan-made sequel comic, and even a Blu-ray release in the United Kingdom. Topic upcoming animated film In December 2014, an information leaked that Sony Pictures had made a deal with Nintendo to create an animated film based on the Mario franchise, but it never materialized. In November 2017, it was reported that Nintendo would be teaming up with Universal Pictures and Illumination to make an animated Mario film. However, in January 2018, Nintendo president Tatsumi Kimishima stated that a deal has not been finalized, but that an announcement will come soon. Kimishima hopes that if the deal is successful, a 2020 release date would be possible. By the end of January 2018, Nintendo announced that the movie will be made with Shigeru Miyamoto and Chris Melodandri co-producing. According to Miyamoto, he knew that the process of making a film was far different from that of making a video game, and wanted a film expert to lead the effort. In Nintendo's work with Universal Parks and Resorts to create Mario-based attractions, Miyamoto had met Melodandri, and they had several discussions. Miyamoto found Melodandri's creative process similar to his own, and felt he would be the proper lead for a Mario film. They had started more earnest discussions of the film as early as 2016, knowing that if they felt it wasn't working that they could easily walk away. However, by the time of the official announcement, Miyamoto said that they have good discussions over the screenplay and feels good progress to a proper film. Melodandri stated that the film was a priority for illumination and that it will most likely come out in 2022. He added that Miyamoto will be front and center with creating the movie. <laughs> Anime. Amada anime series, Super Mario Bros., Amadanameshiri Zu Su Pa Mario Baraza Zu Amada Anime Shirizu, Super Mario Brazazu is a series of three direct-to-video OVAs produced by Studio Junio, licensed by Nintendo, and released on VHS tapes on August 3, 1989 exclusively in Japan. The plot of the episodes involve characters from the Mario franchise in the stories of three fairy tales, Momotaro, Isun Boshi and Snow White. Its cast includes Miyako Endo, Princess Peach, Kinopio, Morton Koopa Jr., Wendy O. Koopa, Toru Furuya, Mario, Masaharu Sato, Koopa, Larry Koopa, Iggy Koopa, Naoki Tatsuda, Luigi, Ludwig von Koopa, Roy Koopa, Lemmy Koopa, and Toshiko Sawada. Narration. A review by Kotaku was very critical of the overall quality of the episodes. Mario Kirby Masterpiece Video, Mario Kabai Ming Zuo Video, Mario Kirby Mesaku Video is a 18-minute edge educational video released by HAL Laboratory in 1995 on VHS exclusively in Japan. 
The purpose of the video is to teach kanji to children by featuring two adventures starring Mario and Kirby separately, with still pictures narrated over by Mayumi Tanaka and kanji transcriptions. Super Mario's Fire Brigade, Supa Mario no Shaofang Dui Super Mario no Shobotai, is a short fire safety public safety announcement video animated by Toei and JC staff, directed by Tatsuyuki Nagai and starring Toru Furuya as Mario and Yu Mizushima as Luigi. There was also another video produced about traffic safety, titled Super Mario Traffic Safety, Supa Mario no Jiaotong and Quan Super Mario no Kutsuanzen. Topic: Comics and Manga. Topic: Super Mario Kun. Super Mario Kun, Supa Mario Kun, Supa Mario Kun is a Japanese Kodomo manga series written and illustrated by Yukio Sawada, Zetian Yukio Sawada Yukio, and serialized in the monthly manga anthology Korokoro Comic. Individual chapters are collected into Tankaban volumes by Shogakukan, who released the first volume on July 27, 1991, and have released 53 volumes. The series has only been licensed in Japan and France, published by Soleil Manga. It follows Mario and his friends through the plot lines of many Mario video games, starting in Super Mario World and reaching as far as Super Mario 3D World. Courses created by Sawada for Super Mario Maker were released on November 6, 2015, with a Super Mario Kun costume unlocked for players who clear them. There is another manga series which ran for five volumes with exactly the same title, written and drawn by Hiroshi Takase, Song Lai Hiroshi, also published by Shogakukan but serialized in Pika Pika Comics. Because of the identical titles, Sawada's and Takase's series are easily confused. Topic. Nintendo Comic System The Nintendo Comics System was a series of comic books published by Valiant Comics in 1990 and 1991. It was part of a licensing deal with Nintendo, featuring characters from their video games and the cartoons based on them. Topic. Super Mario Adventures Super Mario Adventures is an anthology of comics that ran in Nintendo Power throughout 1992, featuring the characters from Nintendo's Mario series and based loosely on Super Mario World. The series was also serialized in Korokoro Comic in 1993. Charlie Nazawa, the artist who created the comics, is also known by the pen name Tamakichi Sakura. Kentaro Takakuma was responsible for the story, which follows Mario and Luigi as they attempt to rescue Princess Peach after she is abducted by Bowser with intent to marry her. Gamebooks Nintendo Gamebooks were gamebooks released in two series, Nintendo Adventure Books and You Decide on the Adventure, and based on video games created by Nintendo. Topic: Electromechanical games. Nintendo has licensed several electromechanical games for use in arcades and casinos, including two popular pinball machines by Gottlieb Super Mario Brothers, released on the 25th of April 1992, was the first Gottlieb machine that included a dot matrix display tracking scores and various animations, and shared a lot of its art assets with Super Mario World, released for SNES two years prior. 4,200 units were manufactured. Super Mario Bros. Mushroom World released a few months later in June 1992, this time based on Super Mario Bros. 3 for NES. Only 519 units were produced, making it significantly rarer and more sought after by modern collectors. Other electromechanical games licensed by Nintendo include a Mario Kart 64 slot machine, as well as a series of Mario Fushigi Metal games starting in 2003 with Super Mario Fushigi no Janjan Land, then Super Mario Fushigi no Korokoro Party in 2004, Super Mario Fushigi no Korokoro Party 2 in 2005, and Mario Party Fushigi no Koro Koro Catcher based on Mario Party 8 in 2009. 
Merchandise Mario has appeared on lunch boxes, t-shirts, magazines, commercials notably, in a Got Milk? commercial, in candy form, on shampoo bottles, cereal, badges, and as a plush toy. Multiple Mario-themed versions of popular board and card games have been released by USAopoly, including Monopoly, Tacdex, and Connect 4. Nintendo has also released in 2017 a puzzle featuring Mario. Topic events National Mario Day is an annual holiday to commemorate the Nintendo video game character Mario, on March 10. This date is chosen because March 10 looks like the name Mario. Gamers can commemorate the occasion by playing games from the series, or with Mario-themed events, and coordinating on social media with the hashtag #NationalMarioDay. In 2014 the Christian Science Monitor advised parents that Mario Day was an opportunity to bond with their children, and listed Mario Day-themed events parents could take their children to, to encourage that bonding. In 2016, Nintendo created a video about the event, where Mario caused chaos in their American offices, and brought some joy to the monotonous workday in the ways only Mario could. Chad Conselmo of Destructoid appears in the video. In March 2013, Nintendo began the Year of Luigi. This included a year of Luigi themed games like Dr. Luigi, Mario and Luigi Dream Team, and new Super Luigi UA Luigi's Mansion statue was released on Club Nintendo. On March 19, 2014, the year of Luigi ended. Topic themed parks Super Nintendo World is an upcoming themed area at various parks within Universal Parks and Resorts. It will be dedicated to characters and settings from Nintendo properties, including Mario, Donkey Kong, The Legend of Zelda, Kirby, Pokémon, and others. Topic music The Super Mario series of video games has a large amount of music, much of it composed by Koji Kondo. The Super Mario Bros. theme is particularly well known. The Super Mario Bros. theme has been featured in many concerts, including Play. Chicago, the Columbus Symphony Orchestra, the Mario and Zelda Big Band Live, Play. A Video Game Symphony, and others. The Video Games Live concert featured the theme performed by Koji Kondo.